Welcome to Any Way You Slice It, where we talk about issues, cares, and frustrations, what we call the slices of life. Come journey with author Ricardo Richardson to the core to reveal identity and purpose. Today's message is The Church. Beloved family, and I tell you that you are Peter, and on this rock I will build my church and the gates of hell will not overcome it. Matthew 16, 18. The Holy Spirit revealed to Peter that Jesus is the Son of God. So Jesus was responding to the statement made by Peter, referring to Jesus as the rock or foundation of the church, not Peter as the rock. Peter understood this as he later recorded in 1 Peter 2, verse 4, As you come to him, the living stone, rejected by humans, but chosen by God and precious to him, you also, like living stones, are being built into a spiritual house to be a holy priesthood, offering spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God through Jesus Christ. We are being built into a spiritual house to be a holy priesthood. This is not referring to a structure made of stone or rocks we call churches. Many are erecting churches or buildings that promote religion instead of relationship. Almost every religion has a temple or church building. Did you know that Satanism is an official religion with a high priest, a Bible, and they worship at the church of Satan? The church Jesus referenced in the Bible is not a building at all, but is the ecclesia, the called out assembly of believers who are sent into the world to teach the kingdom of God as Jesus taught them. Again, Jesus said after he was resurrected, peace be unto you. As the father has sent me, I am sending you. And in the conclusion of Acts, Paul is said to proclaim the kingdom of God and taught about the Lord Jesus Christ with all boldness and without hindrance. A popular verse seen everywhere is, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, John 3.16. But note, a less popular verse with similarities is 1 John 3.16. It says, This is how we know what love is. Jesus Christ laid down his life for us, And we are to lay down our lives for our brothers and sisters. The ecclesia, the called out, the assembly of believers, Jesus called the church. True function is to show love by laying down our lives for our kingdom family and teaching about Christ and the acceptance and return of the kingdom of God. Not simply laying down stones and bricks, using them to promote religion. As you gather to worship God at a physical house, make sure your spiritual house, your temple, your body carries that worship into the world. I love to gather with others to publicly worship God, but we should be just as conscious about our private worship and relationship with Christ because this is the church he is coming back for. The rock of ages is not returning for rock buildings or stones but for the called out believers who have faith in God and his Christ. Finally, Jesus says in the Gospel of John, chapter 4, verse 23, the Passion, from here on, worshiping the Father will not be a matter of the right place, but with the right heart. For God is a spirit, and he longs to have sincere worshipers who worship and adore him in the realm of the Spirit, and truth. Much love.